Yeah, hello everybody, my name's Noogly, welcome back to the McCaz series, part 19. In the last episode, we found ourselves a beautiful, bustling village in the island, uh, that direction. Uh, we have a bunch of animals now. Uh, got ourselves a horse, which is amazing, that's fantastic. Um, now, again, I did some stuff off camera, it's just a lot of, like, you know, Minecraft things, like just mining and crafting originally i was going to make a um automatic sugarcane farm which i did see a video it's not too complicated to make um i actually started to build uh some of the stuff for it so like i needed some repeaters some uh comparators more redstone in general stuff like that um at the moment uh, I need iron for like I think one or two more pistons if I'm not mistaken so I was like eventually I will still do that but while we're in summer I looked up a few different um, like farming patterns for sugarcane and a lot of them was like this checkerboard pattern with the water stuff like that so uh, <laughs> I think we're starting to come out of summertime because none of my sugarcane has grown but basically this is this is essentially every piece of sugarcane that i had and i like lumped it up to start growing and i'm gonna be so angry if summertime's over we're like smack dab in the middle of summer so i don't know why the sugarcane hasn't started to grow uh so i'll go away for a bit because today we're gonna be doing some boring stuff again. Honestly, it's stuff that I could do off camera again. I thought about making a bridge uh, over to the other island. I think it might just be too far. Um, you know, with a lot of time and dedication, we can make a bridge. I think for now what I wanna do is just kind of uh, clear out some trees and stuff like that. Maybe make a dock uh, for the boat over there. Maybe like make a hole in this cave. If anything, I could just sail out from this way. Maybe I could just do like a straight shot. Is that connected over there? Let me get... Actually, I don't think my binoculars will work. I'm just going to sail out there real quick. Okay, so it does look like it's connected. And it's actually not as far as I thought it was, but a bridge might still take quite a while. Um, one day. One day we will. Uh, I actually probably could start with all this wood. <laughs> you know what? That was my original hope, was to make a bridge connecting these islands. Which, of course, obviously, I could just walk around. But, you know, come on, let's start getting somewhere good. So, uh, like I said, I'm just going to do a big old bridge. Um, when I say big bridge, I do kind of mean that. I might do a f um, five lane bridge. Only because I'm thinking about rails. Oh, bamboo, wait. Oh no, birch sapling. I could have swore I just read bamboo. Do I have food? Great, I do not have food. I seen the hunger debuff hit and then I, I actually thought about it. Whew. There are a lot of them. Oh, I just seen more spawn too. Okay, yeah, let's get out of here. I need food anyways. It sucks I won't be able to run if I, if I run into big guy. You know what? I... I really don't want to run into the chance of starving to death. I know my house is close by, but I really don't want to run that chance. Gotta get just two mushrooms. That's all I need, two mushrooms. Let's get them stuck in the bushes. I think this gets mined with sword. Oh my god, axe, axe, axe. Yes, two mushrooms. This is kind of what the forest is actually like. Um, I'm really, really glad that our forest was not like this. Oh sweet, they're getting uh, distracted by something. It's worse too because since it's getting dark, the spawns are going to be even bigger. You know what? It's fine. We got food. Let's uh, go over here and take a nap. I'm going to come back with more food. But yeah, so with a bridge and with some of these trees cleared out, I could ride my horse to the village and back. I don't want to have the horse out yet just because of the fact that... uh. It's not exactly a safe trip yet. Just one more piece, and we can make a full set of fur armor. So, one goal is is almost complete. I don't remember if I mentioned it, but I do believe that we can survive, a, like, maybe a hit or two 
Uh, well, I feel like definitely one hit from big guy, possibly two hits. I do not want to test that theory though. <laughs> and God, I feel like this is going to look so stupid building a bridge right here when again, there's that walkway, but I just, I just feel like this is going to be so much faster. It's going to look so good. And then should I go up one more? Yeah, I'm going to go up one more just because I want to. So for now, I'm just going to like bridge across first. I'm not going to try to do all of it at one time. Worst part too being how uh, <laughs> if we're on the bridge and it starts getting dark, zombies can spawn on the bridge, which is also why we'll need like glowstone or lanterns. Um, why are you out here? That's one of the heroes. Why are, why are you just out here? Almost there. Almost to the shore. Don't worry about the zombie, it's okay. Oh, she can teleport to me? Stay here. Huh. That's very interesting. Will she still fight? She should have plenty of health. Please, please swing at him. Please swing at him. Oh, he's ignoring her. Aha! I have you guys cornered. Oh my god! Stay here. I'll protect you. I think I've mentioned it before, uh, for anyone that's never played RL Craft. Um, <laughs> uh, the hotter you get, the more quickly that your uh, thirst will drain. Oh, sweet, I got I got a twofer. For some reason, two trees fell. Whoa, what was that? I should have enough to make it to the other side. So let's make her follow me. So she should teleport, right? Yes, that is really cool. All I have to do is get her back home. I left my bed, which is where shacks would come in handy. I wonder if I can give the NPCs like armor and stuff. I can give the heroes my old gear. She could have full iron armor, so she's protected. Um, not the tin shield. No one's touching that tin shield. That was mine. I hear another one. I hear a cave dweller. Am I just going crazy? Like. <laughs> Did I just spend too many times, uh, too many nights in caves? Oh, she's just watching me while I sleep. She actually couldn't go inside. Is it the carpet? Oh my god, it's the carpet. Wow. So the the one thing that the Jacob sheep gave me, and it, it messed with my NPCs. Okay, so interact. Uh, shake hand. I can just keep shaking hand and increase hearts. I don't know how many hearts. There are tell story. Wowie, so many hearts, you guys. Locations. Ah, Jesus Christ. This will be my new home point. Okay. So she lives here and I give you sword. What if I shift? Nope. No. Uh, oh, gift. Okay, so I guess that there's specific things that I could gift. Okay, I'll look into that later. I'm gonna make a diamond axe, just so that I don't have to worry about an axe for a while. Oh god, he's attracting more. Dry hands. Oh, I gotta take that, I gotta take that, just because of the meme. You got soft hands. I'm gonna harvest my wheat, and then I'm gonna harvest my sugar cane, and I'm gonna go take off to building the bridge again. So essentially, this is what the bridge is going to look like. Okay. <laughs> Not like that. The bridge won't look like that. So essentially, this is what the bridge is going to look like. And you know what? I think that's pretty cool. It's going to be one big opening just like this. It's going to stretch all the way over there. I don't need this anymore. Oh, there's a bear. Also, I am stupid and just realized if I add railings, it's gonna be a three three entrance anyway. So I'll have to do another line on the sides, which could work with the curved staircases that I wanna do. But for now, this is just what the bridge is gonna look like. I might potentially just use a wooden fence as railing. Uh, but I'll, I'll Google some bridges. Yeah, look at that FOV, guys. <laughs> that's pretty close, and I look, that's pretty far. 
So instead of Quake Pro, let's just try putting it back at 95. Ugh, that hurts my eyes. It just feels so close because of the slowness, you know? With mining fatigue, let's try the Diamond X. It's like, it's like mining dirt with my hands. <laughs> I can't remember if I showed you guys from the beginning of the series. Um, I can actually take all of the undead guts and make a mask. They avoid me. The zombies actually ignore me. The problem is my vision becomes blurry and black and white, just like whenever I'm infected. So it might be worth it to try because I'll at least be able to uh, mine trees without worry or chop trees without worry, I should say. I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys. They might lose aggro immediately. I've never like tried this before. Yep. Oh, wait. Okay, no, it didn't work at all. I could have swore this is supposed to make them ignore me. Slowness, nausea. Oh, it's giving me hunger as well. Uh, invisibility, okay. Uh, oh! So maybe if I get too close. Uh, so it's like, if I'm desperate, I can. <laughs> Oh, it's giving me hunger though, and it's making me sick. Now I don't need a boat. That already frees up one inventory slot. Uh, I can ride my horse across. This is so, so nice. I'm gonna go place some mushrooms over there though. I might do the railings uh, either in stream, or uh, I don't wanna do it off camera. I, I'm t I don't like doing stuff off camera. Just cause, you know, we're all here for the journey. We are all here for the same journey. If I keep doing stuff off camera, it's just like, yeah, I'm, you know, cutting you guys out of the journey. Through this forest, and then I think a bit further is, uh, the village should be, like, in this general direction. Yep, I can see the village in the distance. You know what? I'm gonna be fancy and get my handy-dandy binoculars right there. There's the village. <laughs> Again, as I've mentioned, I'm not gonna clean up the village. Uh, that's too much work. It's just kind of about uh, getting them out. Oh, I can make them ride horses. That's right. I can make the villagers ride horses. So I can just take them along with journeys with me. I'm going to head back to the house for now. Let's get my sword ready. I'm going to start adding uh, an extra line just because, uh, like I said, for the railways. It's time for the flirt. <gasps> okay, 70 hearts. It's time for the hug. Is it time for the kiss? Oh my God. You guys, we maxed out her hearts. Tastes like pumpkin pie. <laughs> we did it, you guys. What? Do I need to download the Jenny mod pack? Uh, we can sleep together. <laughs> 200 hearts. Can they keep going? Oh my god, she loves me, you guys. All right, everyone. Well, I'm going to end this uh, sleeping with my Minecraft girlfriend. Um, <laughs> yeah, do I need to download the stupid Jenny mod? <laughs> Here, let's see. Uh, ring. Wedding ring. And then uh, engagement ring. Have the hearts required to marry someone. Matchmaker's ring. Oh, <laughs> I think I can make that right now. No, I can't. I need uh, one more piece of gold. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Anyways, I'm going to take a sip of water. Uh, oh, wait, wait. I'm going to go harvest my sugar cane. Making a path to the village might be a video itself. That's, that's going to be kind of tricky with all the hills. But we'll get there. We will get there. Thank you all so much for watching this episode. I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.